These, these magnets are so, so strong for their weight and size that they're in getting into everything, you know, electric cars. In fact, the whole electric car technology sort of relies on us having good supplies of this stuff. And they're useful for other things as well. I mean, the... Uh... So the latest use, which is, I think, you know, sort of we're kind of familiar, aren't we, with bits of metal that magnetic. But what about this? This is some oil. Just kind of pour it on just now. Just ordinary, just car oil, is that? Well, this is, yes, yeah, motor oil. And what I'm doing is I'm trying to um, simulate an oil slick. Okay, so okay. imagine this is an ocean. The traditional cleanup method, presumably, is to run a, run a line around it and try to essentially scoop yeah. it off the top. An inventor in Greece came up with a really intriguing way to get rid of oil slicks using magnetism. So he's got this kind of foam-like material. Have a look very, at it. Oh, yeah. It's dry, yeah. It's a bit yeah. like, it feels a bit like polystyrene. Yeah. And it's got a material that likes oil, so the oil is sucked up when you put it on top of it. And then, little magnetic particles in there. So, in theory... <laughs> Let's see if this works. So you can see it being sucked up. Look, yeah, yeah. Look well, it's definitely hoovering up the oil. Yeah. So now all I need is a magnet. Okay. Okay, now look. Oh. Yeah, oh, that's very oh. satisfying. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you think? That I is mean, fantastic. obviously, if this was a massive ocean, I wouldn't be just spreading it further <laughs> around. But you know, you get the idea. This is, you know, there it is, and then you can just take it off. And then you, and, and that pushes off quite easily, doesn't it? It's not like it's it's, it's gonna, as yeah. glued to this as, as the magnet was to the table. There you go. Oh, that's fantastic! Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and could this be done though on a huge industrial scale, or is it? Well, they have done a trial. In fact, I think we've got some VT of this, which. Um... So when, you, when there's lots and lots of oil, mechanical yeah. methods will still be quite yeah. a, a relatively. Efficient. And at the moment, they put detergent in, and that's actually the big problem because those little droplets of oil and detergent then get spread out in the whole ocean, and they, they cause a lot of damage. And wow. So this this is potentially a really interesting solution. That's a very neat. Oh, you can way see it there. Lovely. Well, you can see it. Yeah. Okay. Well, what else have we got? Let's put that oh, yep. that down. Is this oil again? Now, this, this looks like an oil. So this is another idea about trying to do oil slicks. But imagine instead of trying to absorb the oil, what you did is you made the oil magnetic, or at least respond to a magnet. Now, have a look at this. This is just a demo to show the idea. So this is a magnet under here. This, this looks like a normal bit of oil. What they want to do is turn oil into this material. That is uh, fairly astonishing. So this is, this is called a ferrofluid. And, and what it is, actually, is a liquid with tiny little magnets in them. They're so small, they're bonded in a way to the water. And this means it, just, it basically ch takes the water with it. And you get what those peaks are, are those invisible forces that we were all introduced to <laughs> at school about yeah, magnets the, for the, the flux the iron, Like the iron filings yeah. that you would scatter, like whatever, those are just a kind of a 3D so version. This is, of... this is evidence that they are real, you know? And, and this, is, this is a field that you can see. That's um, fantastic. But imagine you could turn an oil slick into this stuff. Then all you'd have to do is get a magnet and you could confine the liquid. And you just basically pull it into a... Yeah, into a well, bottle. you could pull it by doing it this the other way around. If, I, if you hold that... OK. If I put the oil slick on the bottom here... Okay. Ah, <laughs> I know, I know. Business. You're absolutely right. Past history has told us that this is probably bad. Can you put that on there? I'll put that on there. OK, so the magnet is there. Yeah. Now, Feels all around it. Yeah. And then you basically could suck up the liquid. I mean, literally, physically suck it onto a ship. <laughs> How nice is that? It's quite spooky as well. That though. is really <laughs> eerie and wrong. Uh, really um, kind of creepy. And it's actually arranged itself as, uh, along lines of field. Yeah, and it's really messy to get. Yeah, because if I. Because presumably if I take that off, it's just going to come down, splashing down. It will come, do you want to have a try? No, I don't. I'm going to oh, leave you okay. to that.